Hey people, well, here's a video of another fan that's leaving my collection. Uh, only this is one I haven't had very long. This is that Lakewood model P223-M that I got uh, probably around six months ago uh, sometime uh, this past March. I got this because I wanted uh, an older uh, one in that color uh, to go along with the third gen uh, one that I have from circa 1987. As you can see, this one has the older white blade uh, with the grills and the handle and knob also being white. The reason this is leaving is because I got the got one I like better. Uh, got the one I really want, which was the later with the later tan blade uh, with the grills and the handle and knob also being tan or almond. And if this one didn't have the box, or or if the other one didn't have the box, uh, I would have kept this one. But since uh, the one I got has the box, I'm going to have to part ways with this one. This one, just like the, like the Galaxy uh, 3713 that I showed in the last video, this one will also be going to uh, my, my friend uh, Taylor the Engine. And here's the box, which as you can see, um, it's faded, it's kind of faded midway uh, on down to the bottom. And this is the only section that doesn't have any fading uh, other than the top. It's faded uh, here. As well as on the back. And, and the top's the only other section that doesn't have any fading. And now the fan itself. This fan was pretty dirty when I got it, but it cleaned up well. Uh, what is now the front grill was originally the back grill. Because the back grill, which was originally the front grill, was a little bit more yellowed. than the uh, current front grill. So I switched them around. Now I'll have them you know, look at the other sections of the fan. And as you can see, it's the mocha brown color. One of the early ones in that color. They probably came out with uh, certain ones in that color probably in late 1981. And they switched the style of speed sticker this one has. And this one, unlike the later one, has a smooth paint job. As does the even later one from 87. Well, the texture may still be smooth, the paint job is probably still shoddy in some places, maybe on the inside, I don't know. There's the other side. back. 
And as I said, this was originally the front grill. You may not be able to tell on camera, but it's a bit more yellow than what is now the front grill, which was originally the back grill. And of course, this is an early one. It's got the older McMillan motor with the wingtip stator. Date cut on the motor is F83, meaning this was produced in June of 1983. Turn it back around. Now view the top. There's the metallic brown sticker. As I said, it's probably uh, when they came out with the style of sticker in late 1981 that they came out with a series that was in the brown color. Like this one. And of course, the um, panel and knob on this one are still white, as I said. And now we'll run this for the last time. It's high. And like a, like most Lakewoods of that era, it's got a nice quiet low. Back to high. And over the left, smells off. Uh, coast down time seems to be a little short, but I did oil it as best I could. So, so anyway, this is the final video of this uh, Lakewood model P223-M for it goes to my friend Taylor the Engine with the uh, original box. So, thank you for watching.